Hi there, this is Abhishek and in this video uh, I will walk you through about how you can improve your end user performance. So many times there are scenarios like your chart like this bar chart or any other chart is taking a lot of time to display the information and generally it happens because whenever we open our dashboard or do a lot of selections or remove the selection you know entire data gets loaded into the chart and because of that your user performance gets hit because it may happen that your chart is taking 10 second 20 second 15 or maybe even a minute to refresh and show you that show the information back to the end user and it is because you use a lot of functions a lot of calculations within the chart and when they become really really complex click view engine find it's difficult to do the processing very quickly and that's why it enhances or it increases the times so idea is that uh, how you can control it this kind of expression and make sure that user always have uh, some sort of restriction in mind for the benefit of end user performance or application performance so for that the idea is that uh, whenever your chart is getting refreshed uh, it should be refreshed based on at least one value selected from here and then uh, only your chart should display the uh, relevant uh, information updated with the help of the bars so for that what you can do is you can right click on the chart go to the properties and within the general term you have calculation condition that means when the cal when should be the calculation satisfied uh, you can specify here so what i need is that at least one value is selected from this state hyphen union territories list box then only my calculation should do a calculate uh, bar chart calculation so for that what i need to write is if get field or get uh, count i need to get selected count and name of the field field name is state ut so what i'm saying is that if my get selection count from this field is greater than zero that means at least one is selected then only show the chart that's why one is indicate and one is indicating that then only you need to show the chart and zero is indicating that no need to do the calculation so if my any of the value is selected from this list box then only do the calculation otherwise don't do the calculation once you click apply and okay so it's it is saying calculation condition unfulfilled well for that if you want it to be fulfilled we will click on any of the chart and it will start displaying you the information so the idea is that uh, your chart is not taking a lot of time when you have accidentally leave or left the uh, this list box unselected and because of that it is impacting the entire application uh, time to, which which impacts the overall user experience so if that is a requirement for one of your chart which is really really heavy and making other charts non-functional then you can go into this properties of the chart within the general specify the calculation condition and make the better user performance also another thing is about error messages so if i just click ok and remove the selection it is saying that calculation condition unfulfilled now as a developer you know that the calculation condition is unfulfilled but for end user it is not a meaningful information so to make to show the meaningful information what you can do is go into the properties again within the general go to the error messages select condition unfulfilled and say is select at least one value from state hyphen you union territories list box now this this is much more meaningful as compared to the previous message conditional uh, calculation condition unfold now user know that what it needs to do so please select at least one value from state duties all right let's do that let's select the heart so now you have the values over here and user can very easily guide it to the what action it needs to perform so that's what I wanted to discuss in this video and hope uh, you will be able to utilize and make your application performance better.